dad was a tool maker, so when I was a kid, I used to go into his shop, and I saw him running his machines, and I knew from then on that's what I wanted to do. My name's Rob Freewert. I'm a tool maker and machinist at Genico Machine Works in South Elgin, Illinois. I arrive at 5 in the morning and I typically leave at 3.30 in the afternoon, so it's a 10 hour day. I put on my, my safety equipment, I power up my machines, and then we start machining. Today I'll be making components for a high speed assembly machine. So typically a job order will come in where it's processed in the office, we get a job traveler, it'll have basic information, basically everything you need to process the job. Quantities, material types, dimensions, and from there we program it. Programming on a simple part could be as little as 10-15 minutes, or I mean it could be the better part of a day on a complex part. We work with a 3D model, it's usually a step file, and that's the Bible we call it. That's what we go by, that's where all the true geometry is. We pull that off, we tool path it, and then we send it out to the machine where the machine does all the cutting. So the main piece of equipment that I run is a 3-axis CNC vertical mill. In the CNC machine, we're using cutters, drills, carbide insert, high-speed tools to remove the different materials. If there's maintenance involved in the machines, you have to make sure they're lubed and oiled properly. If the machine's not oiled properly, it could be catastrophic failures where the spindle will lock up and seize, and then uh, you're down, you're not machining, you're out of business. favorite aspect of this job is the variety, the type of work we get in, the different materials I work with, the complexity of the parts. Working with the different materials can be one of the biggest challenges. We work with a lot of tool steels, aluminum, stainless steels, some plastics. While machining them, you have to keep in mind that each of them have different natures about them. Some of them want to spring and move on you when you're machining them, so you have to allow for stock to clean up for finished cuts and finished processes. Jobs can take anywhere from a couple hours to several days, depending on the processes involved. The more processes that are involved, I think the more I enjoy it. Sometimes, I mean, things don't work out the way you plan. There's a lot of planning involved, but then that's the beauty of it. It's, uh, there's always another project after it where you could, uh, you know, you get right back into it, redeem yourself. The challenge, it makes a day go by. It makes you feel like you're earning your money. They give me the freedom to move around, to use my creativity to manufacture the parts. I get to take parts from start to finish. I get to see the raw material come into a finished product. And that to me is, is very rewarding.